I think it's important for us to realize that we're still in the middle of a pandemic. In the beginning when the COVID hit, we really don't know. The only thing we knew was SARS, but we don't know, but we, but we do know that it can mutate because it's an mRNA virus. You know, even the nationally, they don't know exactly what was going to happen. So we were left in the dark, but we learn as we go. You know, right now we have the vaccine, and that's one of the tools, the arsenal that we have against the virus. Right now, if you are pregnant, the current national recommendation is to get vaccinated. And we've been encouraging that, especially if you're diabetic or you're hypertensive. Now, I want to make it real clear that there are adverse events. With any vaccine that you get, you can get a reaction. With any medication you take, there can be an adverse event. So what we do, we track those data, especially through the first trimester. From miscarriages, from bleeding, you know, any kind of allergic reactions, we actually enter the VAR system, which is a national system. And I want to make sure people understand this because even though we're tracking the data, it doesn't mean that we discourage vaccination. We actually encourage it, especially if you're pregnant, because we know for a fact if you get vaccinated, your illnesses, the severity will go down. So you have to make a decision. Right now, CDC is saying that, you know, the benefit outweighs the risk or the potential risk of the vaccine. If you catch COVID, especially in your second and third trimester, you can get very sick because your blood volume is up. You know, if you think about it, you're carrying like a watermelon and it's pushing up in your chest. Your, your respiratory rate is already impacted. So if you get COVID, it's going to impact on your breathing movements. So right there and there, you know your lung capacity is already at the limit. So you got to make sure. If you worry about the first trimester, it's okay. You get it in the second or third trimester, but get the vaccine. That's what we recommend. If I can get the one message across to everybody that's uh, on this island is that we are a small unit. We have to roll together because if you roll one way and you go the other way, you're not, you're not, you're not going to get to your destination. And right now, our destination to get out of this pandemic, so we have to work together. And my heart is to get us out of this pandemic.